The Toronto Argonauts are 10 and a half point favorites at home against the Montreal Alouettes to kick off the CFL's triple header on Saturday. The Argos have a chance to clinch a playoff spot and all but wrap up the East Division with a win, while the Owls are 0-5 against the league's top three teams this season. Can Montreal cover or even win on the road? I actually yeah, I have like a- this spot for the Alouettes, but I'll let you go first, JC. <laughs> <laughs> uh, smooth smooth though good recovery no i uh i have a hard time looking at this line and seeing a circumstance where the alouettes can cover and i know it's a massive 10 and a half points i get that and the argos are coming down off a labor day high but this team is just better than everyone else in the east I, as plain and simple as that and the alouettes may be the number two team but they're a, a solid tier below. I think Chad Kelly is motivated by the money that's now in his pocket. I think he's going to have another great performance. And the Alouettes are going to go into another three-game losing streak. Chad Kelly has usually bounced back from mediocre performances this season. And what I'm talking about is the two interceptions that he actually singled out that he threw in Hamilton at Tim Hortons Field on Labor Day. But the Argos still got a big, easy win. And I think Toronto is head and shoulders, maybe even up to their waist above everybody else in the East Division. But the Alouettes know what's on the line here, so I think they come out with a scrappy effort. Montreal was close to covering against BC last week, so the Argos win at home, but it is somewhat of a potential letdown spot after a big rivalry game and a huge win for the Argos against their rivals down the QEW in Hamilton. So the double blue win but the Alouettes cover. I like the Alouettes to cover here, and it's largely because of how disinterested, frankly, the Argos looked for a lot of Labor Day. They got out to a 17 nothing lead, and then they looked like they went on autopilot for two quarters, just because they could. They're like, yeah, we got this. We, we, we know we're the better team, and it's not even close. And they scored, I think, on four consecutive drives to close things out. They put up 41 points. But to me, that shows maybe a little bit of complacency from a team that, as we know, is, I think, the best in the league, right? We've got them at number one of our power rankings have for over a month at this point. Um, They're great, but they don't appear interested in killing teams. They appear interested in building leads and then coasting until they have to score again late in the game. So I like the Argos to win, but I like the Alouettes to cover. 